Welcome to Real Life Wednesday, where we talk about where life and real faith intersect. Today, we're going to be talking about a life of faith lived for God's good. There's a story that is uh, told by many people better than me. Uh, basically, though, it's about a, a man, a good Christian man that got uh, in, a, in a shipwreck. And he was a sole survivor. He got washed up uh, alive on a uninhabited island. And on this island, uh, he searched for food and, and, and nothing uh, was there. He could barely get by, but he was able to come with some meager provisions. And he said, well, just as a faithful Christian, I'm going to pray earnestly and feverishly. And he did. He prayed and he prayed and he prayed. Um, and, and after praying for days, um, there was still no rescue. So he ended up building a, 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 a hut out of driftwood and had some meager possessions over time. And he was out one day foraging for food um, and, and he came back and his hut was, was on fire, completely aflame and smoke was billowing in the air. It was a terrible thing. And he was so down and he said, God, why would you allow this terrible thing to happen? Every little thing I own, which is so little already because the shipwreck is, was in that hut. Now I don't have any shelter. It's terrible. Um, and he was just weeping and crying, fell asleep, weeping and crying to God. The next day, uh, he was woken up by a ship coming uh, and, and they rescued him. And, and he said, how did you know uh, I was on this island? How did you know, I, you, you know to rescue me? And, and they said, well, we saw uh, your, your fire. We saw the, the smoke in the air, so we knew that you were in need. It says in Romans 8, 28, these very important words. And we know that all things work together for the good of them that love God, who are called according to His purpose. All things work together for God's good, for God's glory, when we seek to follow Him and His will. It doesn't always look like it. And sometimes we wonder why there's this pain, why there's this heartache. But may we trust that in the end, it's all for His good. May we do just that. Amen and amen.